Okay, so this is an example of really the best free web developing tool um, for Windows anyway that I've really come across aside from Web Expression Blend or um, or uh, let's say Dreamweaver or the like. Okay, so this is designed to show you how to import a website. We're going to take Facebook basically and make it ours in 25 seconds, not even. Okay, so what we have here is uh, Microsoft Office SharePoint Designer 2007. I can open it up here. It's just a standard untitled. We're going to go to right click, go to import, import site wizard, HTTP. We're going to type in facebook.com, select access in the site right now. This is similar to taking all the source code out. If you do view page source, it's just direct. I could actually import this 9, 10, 11, 13 levels deep. So if a page or a website went down that far, or a website specifically rather, it would take all those pages down to whatever nth degree I desired it to go to. So now we're going to go in and we're going to take Facebook. And then we're going to publish it when we're done with that. Okay, so now that we've imported all that, we should be able to access it from our website. Okay, and uh, this import has worked. It's gone through. As you can see, these uh, they're using PHP to make Facebook, basically. So I log in, and I can change it here. Facebook. Oh, I don't know if it sounds so right. Whoops. Let's make sure this is right. Uh, I think that looks a little bit more more honest, I guess. Anyway, let's preview this. <clears throat> Alright, so there we go. Uh, you just imported Facebook basically in its entirety. And this is actually how some uh, amount of uh, uh, hacking gets done. Or not hacking, but really um, people going in and making sites that look like sites, but actually they really just want to take your data. Um, and it's happened with a number of big gaming websites and things like that. But that's how you take a page in uh, 25 seconds. Thanks.